Hi, I'm Kelly Thompson. I'm a leadership coach. I want to talk about a hard lesson that I had to learn about investing in myself. You see, when I was in corporate America, there was this women's organization that every year had this wonderful development program. And every year, I just hoped that I would get picked to be one of the people inside my organization that got to attend this really well-known program. And every year I was disappointed because I was never picked for this program. I even went to the point where I started to volunteer for this organization just so I could get into their conference for free because I was never picked to go through the big, long, formal development program. And it didn't occur to me until I was an entrepreneur how much I relied on my corporate company to fund my own personal development. Because you see, when you go out on your own, I don't have an employer that pays for my employee development or my tuition. And so I realized that I had to put my own budget line item in for my own personal development. And I had a huge aha. I thought to myself, why didn't I ever think about paying for that development that I wanted for myself? Why didn't I have my own budget line item? Honestly, if I wanted to, I didn't have the money at the time. However, I probably could have found maybe a few more inexpensive programs that would have also filled my bucket. Here's the reality. The Association for Talent Development found that on average, large employers spend about $1,300 per person on training. But the problem is, is that most of this training is compliance training, sales training, job specific training, or it's training, leadership training that's offered on behalf of the organization. And they're working really hard to shape you into the leader that they need you to be and teaching you the skills that they want. Here's what I would argue for women leaders is I want you to start asking yourself, am I spending more time in my development at work becoming who they need me to be? Or am I spending intentional time and effort, spending money, investing in development programs, books, on becoming who I am meant to be, finding the skills that I'm meant to lead with, creating and developing what makes me an effective leader and what makes me happy? So here's my challenge for you. Start developing and creating a developmental line item for yourself for your developmental budget. It doesn't even have to be super expensive, but what personal investment are you making in yourself, your career, so you can show up as the best version of you? It could be books. It could be online courses. It could be free webinars. It could be investing in a women's leadership program. There are so many resources available at a variety of different price points. But at the end of the day, it's important to choose yourself and invest in yourself so that you're cultivating the skills that make you the leader you're meant to be and not just showing up and going along with who your company needs you to be. If you want more tips like this, you can find me on social media at Kelly Ray Thompson or find out more about my programs at kellyraythompson.com.